There are two things you need to do. To send a story to Publish2, where it will be shared with all the other Freedom Papers. The first is you need to set the category, and the second, you need to actually tell the system to send the story to Publish2. Both of these are very simple. The first one, to set the category, click on your story and then click on the routing button, or right-click and choose the routing button down here. Either way, it's going to come up with this window right here called the Internet Export Options, and all you need to do, you click on Category right here, and you pick the category of your story. That's it. Don't worry about any of the other fields, just click OK. And we finished setting the category. The next thing you need to do is to send the story to Publish2. The way to do that is to change the status of the story, and the status you need to send it to is Route. The way to do this is a couple of ways. You can either click on the Details button or hit right click, go to Details, Status right here, Find Route, hit Save, and the story will have just been sent to Publish2. And within a couple minutes, we'll be with all the other Freedom Papers. The other way to send the story, and the easier one, is select your story and hit the Tab key. At that point, this little interface comes up, and then you can either hit the 6 on your keyboard or click on this field. And now you get a drop down of all the statuses. In this case, we just select Route and either click OK or hit Enter, and done. Now, you can either use the Tab key or the Details window. The important thing to know, if a story was already once sent to Publish2 and you want to send it again for the second time or however often you want to send it, Details window is not going to resend a story that was already sent once. Only the Tab method will send it again. Just hit 6, hit R, and hit Return, and it just went again to Publish2. That's all you need to know. If you have any questions, please ask your IT or let us know here at APT. Thank you.